for being red. Oh, okay. Um, hello. Can my mic just please work for two seconds? Okay, I think now it's working. Um, hello there. That's what I was trying to say. But, uh, my microphone wouldn't love me. This is a really chill OST. Just really puts you in a different kind of vibe. I think I've done everything now that I need to do. Um, yeah, I'll just let this keep running until it's over. Which is about half a minute. And then I'll uh, start. Nope, sorry, we're not doing that. I need to... Oh, you know, you know what? I'll actually keep it going, because I still need to turn on the game audio. There we go. Okay, so it's been a while since I've streamed this game. Um, yeah, it feels kind of weird going back to this. It's been like a month. Um, but yeah, this is, um, I would say this is where it all started, but this is actually not the first game I ever played on stream. It's just the game I tend to play on stream. And uh, I don't even know where it was at last time. But apparently I was doing this stage. Um... Oh right, this was the uh, right side da cavern stage. The, the, uh, that one. I really like this one. Um, so... I remember going down here uh, to find a secret. But wait. No, let me try it. There we go. Cat. But this is the best part of the entire stage. Uh, anyway, let's actually continue. Um, so, I do not remember what's past this point. I just know that there are two rooms left. Uh, that I do remember. Okay, so I probably need to... I need to fall in there with enough speed. So I probably need to fast fall, actually. Um, which is actually funny. I think that's like one of the only times you really need to fast fall instead of just being, you know, fast. Um, you actually have to do it to get enough momentum to get that dash crystal. You know, usually you just fast fall to go fast. Now you just fast fall as tech. If you know what I'm saying. You probably don't know what I'm saying. I also don't know what I'm saying. Um, this is actually quite hard to like line this up. Okay, and then I need to dash. Probably. Oops. Okay, I need to fast fall up. That's... Yeah, that makes sense, I guess. You know, it, it probably was a mistake to start with this stage, but it was just the one I happened to be playing last time. So... You know, would be a shame not to finish it now. Oh, that was close. 
I think, I think that's how fast, like you can fast fall up, right? Or does that not work that way? Yeah, yeah, it's, it is actually reversed like everything else. Okay. So I just need to do more of that. Sometimes I have a feeling it's not fast falling, even though I'm like holding down as much as I can. There we go. Okay. How long is this room, by the way? Um, if this is gonna take ages, then... Damn. Okay, so... That again? Okay, this is just... Nothing special. Yeah. And then... What do you do here? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can go up. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's reversed. I forgot. Okay. You know, I might be... Oh, wow, that was something. Uh, I might be deceiving myself here, but, like, the game... Like, the graphics feel slightly different than they were before. And I don't know if that's just my imagination, or... I don't know, my glasses are less... Um, troubled, overcast, whatever you say in English, I don't know. Um, you know, there's less... things getting in the way. They're, they're clearer. Um, but, uh, uh... I don't know. I have the feeling the graphics are slightly better. <laughs> I'm probably just imagining that. Or maybe that was was the Everest update. Maybe they added RTX or something, I don't know. Actually, I did recently install an update for one of my... Uh, for one of the drivers on this computer. So you know what, that might, that might actually just be that. It might actually be like RTX or something, I don't know. It would be kind of funny. I don't even know like what I would need to look out for. <laughs> because I, I, you know, I haven't had the luxury of an, ever turning on RTX and actually knowing what it's like. I just know it exists. Man, this is a really hard first room to start off with. God. Okay. Oh, that was close. Just, it's always the third one that just doesn't work for some reason. Okay. You know, this OST is a lot like the Pikmin one uh, from before. It's very calming, so you know, I can listen to this for hours. And in fact I have, because I've been playing this for over an hour. Uh, you know, including yesterday, as you can see from the top left of the screen. Please, it just... <laughs> just fast fall. I, I might have to actually do this with the D-pad. Oh, I yeah, D-pad is a lot easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm definitely doing this room with D-pad. Weird. Feels like the camera's slightly off. I don't know. Probably just my imagination. Ooh, that's way easier. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the third one, the 
this one I don't have to do anything. Uh, hi Riley, how are you doing? Oh god, um, okay. You know, f the one time using the d-pad is actually useful. Wow, I can't believe Derp finally found a way to skip the skip that skips 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 Derp potato. Yeah, right? I think I got the number of of skips right, by the way. Um, you know, my brain, when like I'm reading a word that has like multiple of the same syllable, I just... You know, sometimes I I just have like a short circuit, like repetition, or that, that's maybe not the best example. But you know, like words that have like t -t or something like that, like, you know, words that have like two syllables that are basically the same uh, repeated after one another. When I read that, my brain just goes like, oh, okay, yeah, sure. And I, I usually just... Uh, I'm unable to, you know, I, I usually, either I skip one of them, or I say, like, one of them two times. Uh, thanks for the good luck, by the way. Yeah, this stage is really confusing, and I probably shouldn't have started with it, but hey. Um, only... Two rooms left, I think. I, I I should have actually checked. I'm, I'm saying that it's only two rooms, but I should have actually checked. Okay, okay. Oh, almost. Okay. Oh, that was... This room is not that difficult, actually, with the D-pad. You just have to know to use the D-pad. You know, pods probably struck. Uh, not not pods. Parrot Dash probably struggled a bit with this room because she uh she plays with a joystick. I mean, I do too, but for for stuff like that, using a joystick is just not consistent in the slightest. Okay. Uh, anyway, so we have a room. Uh, by the way, I should probably check if this is actually the last room. Uh, we are currently in Vamp 9. Yeah, that's okay. It says final, but the final room is usually just a heart room. So, not a hard room, a heart room. Yeah, yeah, this definitely looks like the end. Okay, yeah. So we just need to do this part. Alright, so... We've got um, this block, which I don't remember exactly what it does. Oh, no, wait, it's... A spring that can uh, change our direction, but in both directions. That's why there's two arrows. Um, then, yeah, do some weird stuff here. Oh, the spring is probably going to fall and we can use it twice. Then there's a platform here, which we probably need to use. So we need to be upside down, which means, yeah, we'll need to use it twice. That makes sense because we're already upside down. You know? Yeah. It's a boolean. Are you upside down? Yes or no? Tr true or false? Um, then... Yeah... Not sure what I'll do here... To flip myself... But... You know, maybe it'll... Become obvious... And then... Some more springs and stuff... And... Yeah! Okay... Let's just do this... As my mom always used to say, and uh, I don't know why I'm saying used to say because she's still alive and she's still very much saying that. Uh, you know, don't look at the explanation too much, just do it. Just, you know, learn by doing it. It'll become clear. She, she probably had a more eloquent way of saying that. Uh, but I don't. I don't know where I got the word eloquent from, by the way. I don't even know if that's the right context to use that in. Uh, but hey. I also just completely went through that spinner. Uh, wow. You know, I haven't, uh, I haven't been playing for that long. The, the spinner stun hasn't activated yet. 
Okay, that's how you do that. So, see, as I, as I said, or as my mom would say, um, it all became clear how to do this part. Just do this. And then you dash. Uh, by the way, Riley- oh, god. I forgot it what <laughs> I forgot it went upside down. Uh, by the way, Riley, is the audio balance okay? Because, you know, this game, I think, is slightly louder <laughs> than uh, Celeste 64. So I might have adjusted it a bit for Select 64, but yeah, I don't know if it's good now. Also realized uh, recently, and with recently I mean like this week, is that for the um, you know the Celeste 64 stream and the Windswept stream that I did, you know when I'm doing a YouTube highlight, I've made, made the system where I can easily um, basically when I'm recording in OBS, I've set it so that there's a separate audio track for everything. So, there's a separate audio track for my voice, there's a separate audio track for the game audio, for the music that I'm playing in the intro, uh, for stream alerts, which... Actually, wait a sec. Yeah, okay, it's not doing anything right now, that's how it should be. Um, stream alerts, which... Sometimes the stream alerts also picks up some other stuff. Um, I tried fixing it, like yesterday and I, I, I saw that it did some weird stuff so I hope it works but you know someone will have to follow me <laughs> to know if it actually works or not no don't please don't do that for the sake of actually trusting it um, or you know someone can raid me no I'm joking um, But yeah, anyway, so I have the thing, I have the separate audio tracks, but that only holds when, true when I'm recording. And, you know, you can stream and record at the same time in OBS. And I forgot to. So now everything is one audio track, which means it's going to be a pain to edit, because I'll probably want to, you know, play different music over it, and I have no idea how I'm going to do that. So, yeah, fun, fun for the whole, um, I was going to say family, but I don't know, just fun, yahoo. Okay, that is not going how it should, I think. I think... Oh, wait, it says... This thing has two arrows. Does it mean it flips twice? If so, I'm not doing that correctly. Um, do I just skip it or something? Maybe I just skip that. I don't know. Uh, can you please just... Okay. Or maybe... Maybe I was too high up. Because, you know... One as... Oh no, wait. Actually, that makes sense. No, wait. Um... Oh, you can only use the spring ones, so that means I'm probably using it wrong. Okay. Maybe I used this spring again? It would surprise me. But... No, it also goes away. Okay. Neutraling upside down, let's go. Okay.
Yeah, yeah, it definitely just goes up. So I... Oh, I think... Yeah, I think I know what that does. Yeah, no, 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 right. Um, in that case, I need to... Yeah, I think I figured it out. So you just do this. I go over here. No, wait, that still doesn't work. Um, you... You know... You do this, then you do not that. Okay, I actually straight up just don't know what to do. Um, I was trying to think like maybe I activate one spring less and that way I'm white side up. And then I can do something that way, but there's literally no way to do it, I think. So like you have to activate this one and you also have to activate that one. So, yeah. Maybe I just... Oh, yeah, maybe I just dash into this one really quickly. So that it basically doesn't kill me and it can flip me over again. Which, I don't really see the point in that, but... Maybe it's useful. Who knows? Uh, no, it just instantly kills you. Okay. There's no way to... But let me try one more time, and if I don't get it that way, then I just literally don't know what to do. And I'm just going to uh, consult the enter. Okay, that was not... That was not a good attempt. That was not a representative sample of my attempts. But I don't know why I'm talking statistics now. But hey. School's starting tomorrow again, so, you know, maybe, maybe it's that. Although, actually, in, in maths class, we're seeing a probability and not statistics. But statistics is coming right after this, so... And they're, like, equally boring. As in, like, you know, pra probably very useful in a practical sense, but the, th the theory that you actually learn is not that interesting. And if you're wondering how I can, how I'm able to say that uh, without actually having seen statistics and uh, probability, it's because we already have actually. Um, okay, that was that was a representative sample. I I can't do this right. Okay, so if you're wondering why I can complain about statistics and probability if I haven't actually seen that yet, is because we have. Um, in like, like three years ago we had a bit of statistics, just the basics, and like two years ago we had like the basics of probability in math class. So like now it's probably just, you know, yeah, just harder. Uh, anyway, um, I'm just going to look up how to do this room. So strawberry jam, advanced lobby. Uh, right side down cavern. That was the name, I think. I will have to say, this is a really good map. Um, I'm positively impressed by this map. Okay, uh, let me see, wait, so, yeah, this is the same thing. Okay, they do um, a hyper, or they do a wave dash off the first block, but it's like functionally identical. They do two dashes off that one, that doesn't really matter all that much. Oh, but they do do two dashes off that one, which actually does change the game a bit. Yeah, 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 and then that one, okay, yeah. Wow, that's uh, quite a intricate, actually. Now you have to do the rest of the room all upside down. Terrific, terrific. Okay, so now I know how to do it. I just need to do it. Okay, so we do this as normal. Um, 
Actually, because I need to do this at the end of the room, I'm just going to do this already. Um, because you need to do that at the end anyway. So yeah. Okay, I'm... It's not very consistent, actually. Let me just do this instead. I don't know if this is much more consistent, but I'm used to it, so... Let's just do this. And then this, you have to do it twice. Which, um... Yeah, but, like, it makes sense. Um... And actually, I was considering doing it. But I thought, you know, this map is, like... Like, clearly, like, also the the thing is going away, so, like, this map usually doesn't force you to, like, hit an element twice quickly before it dis- or, uh, no, wait. Never mind, I don't know what I'm saying. Like, the literally the first spring is a spring that goes away, I have to hit it twice. Um, yeah. I- uh, just, I- I haven't said anything. Yeah, uh... Yeah, I should have known. Like, also the fact that it says you can flip in both ways with it, like, that's sort of been a dead giveaway, actually, that I- you have to use it twice. Yeah, I don't know, man. This is coming from the person who beat Baba as you. Uh, the person, yes. <laughs> There's only one. No, uh, this is coming from a person who has beaten Baba as you. Um, and done all of the really hard stages. Um, I did have to look some of them up. But I did return of uh, Scenic Pond legitimately without looking it up. And I'm so proud of myself for doing that. I, I don't remember what the solution is at all, but I know I got it somehow. And it took me like an hour to get. And I was like so satisfied when I got it. Anyway, um, yeah, to think that, like, the same person who did that is unable to figure out a puzzle this simple that probably wasn't even meant to be a puzzle, just, just an obstacle in a video game that doesn't really, you know, it's just more of an execution challenge than anything. Yeah, I don't know. It's a bit weird. I have two sides. The side that can beat Baba is you. <laughs> And the side that just streams and just has no intelligence whatsoever. You know, if Baba as you is the uh, alpha male side of me, then uh, then this is the I was going to say fanboy side. <laughs> no, um. The... wait... What's like... What's like the opposite of an alpha male? Yeah, I guess it would be... I don't know... You know what I mean, like the opposite of like... Sigma male grind set. Okay, I would quite like to actually beat this room now. Okay, almost. That was almost it. Like, the, the second half of the room is just doing a bunch of super dashes upside down. It's nothing special. If I die to the second half, then I'm just bad. Like, you can... Uh, you can... Um, you can comment on that. But I'm not going to fail it. I, I can fail this as much as I want, I don't care. Uh, I just don't- I, I'm not allowed, legally, to fail the second half. Imagine you're doing a golden run of this, or like a silver berry run, where you can't die, and you die to the second half of this. That doesn't count, that was not the second half yet. The second half starts after that wave dash. And when, when we reach the first block, just so I don't, like, get some stupid wave dash that doesn't quite reach, that doesn't. 
That doesn't count as second half. I need to actually reach the first block after that. Okay, I doing a reverse is surprisingly hard there. Um, oops, that was not what I needed to do. You know, you can probably see my inputs better than I can, so you're probably cringing at what I'm doing wrong here. Uh, but y yeah. I mean, I also know what I'm doing wrong, for the most part. Okay! Uh, oh my god, I almost died. And that would have been very, uh, embarrassing. Please make it. Okay, thank god. I didn't die on the second half. That was legally binding. I, I almost forgot I could grab, by the way. Like, I, I was almost going to neutral up the block. Uh, anyway, um, there's nothing there. Uh, it looks like there would be something behind there. You know, like behind here. Maybe there is. Oh, yeah, th there's something, but I don't think it's very... I don't think it's anything interesting. But yeah, we started the sage right side up and we finished it upside down. Good narrative progression. I like it. But yeah, um, that's the first stage done of this, uh, 742. I I've had a different stage where I had like 427 deaths. Like, this game is tantalizing me with like, almost getting 247. Which is a reference to Parrot Dash, by the way. Uh, if you don't get it, I also don't get it. It's just a number that they like. Like, yeah, 427 in Golden Dawn, you know, like the employee number of Stanley from the Stanley Parable. And then we have 742. Almost 5,000 deaths on the advanced lobby already. Damn. But yeah, anyway, that was the first level of the stream. Um, Let me just check that everything is working. I just do that. I'm like really cautious of that now because I had one stream where my microphone just didn't work for the entire stream and I just hated myself because of it. It wasn't a very interesting stream. It was like half of it was me playing Dropsol. But still. Yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, let's just continue with the next stage that I come across because there's still quite a few. So, you know. We're not at the point yet where I have to actually start looking for the next stage. I just have to wander around a bit and I'll find one. Oh, right here. This is Jellyfish Chankton. Oh, I, I... This name... Yeah, this OST sounds familiar. Okay, yeah. This is, um... Jankton. I don't know, I might have actually mispronounced it, I don't know, but... Hi, just Julius. Um, yeah, it's been a while, uh, I think. It's been like a month. I mean, it's also been a month since I've streamed this game, so... Yeah. Um, oh yeah, if we dash... Okay, these go up. So I assume these are just jollies, but you can only stand on them, not actually do anything with them. And that was a death. Oh yeah, you need to do this. Or not. You, you just need to do... No? Uh, wait, let me just... Also, um... Wait a sec. But yeah, uh, how are you doing? Um... I hope you're doing well. Uh, one parry? Is that it? Let me check. Yeah, okay. There's also a room that says uwu. Filler 10. Amazing. Okay. Uh, you probably need to do actually, you know, you, you probably need to do actual dash tricks here. Um, 
No, not something like that. I forgot to check what color this was. I, I hope it wasn't red. Because the previous one was also red, I think. But hey, you know, I need to do all of the maps anyway, so it doesn't really matter if I do two hard ones at the same time. Or uh, not at the same time. That would be hard, doing two maps at the same time. Uh, Let's just re-enter. Uh, I assume I just throw this and then go like this and die. That, that was already closer, but I'm making progress in some capacity. I keep thinking the springs will push me upside down now. Oh god, the, the previous level has tainted me. You know, maybe this wasn't the right combination of levels to do. But then again, I mean, I think most levels in this have springs, so it, it it's not like it would have really mattered anyway. Like, springs are such a... Like, uh, springs are an element you can really use in any stage. Um, actually... You know... Um, some people will tr probably try to make a stage that doesn't work with springs at all. Uh, just don't. Oh yeah, I forgot, you can also stand on the jellies, even if they're, you know... Yeah, you can just do this, okay. Oh, you can actually do this. This is probably a bit more consistent. Uh, whoops. Okay. Yeah, I'm just dashing like this. Uh, I need that, probably. Yeah. Uh, let's just pretend I got that. Uh, or not. Okay. And I need a dash after that. Uh, oops. Oh, I probably need to do a wave dash and then after that get the jolly. That way I can actually... Uh, that was not a wave dash. And I also did get the jelly. Yeah, something like that. Okay, maybe I do need to do a super dash, just so I get enough height to actually... Mm, I'm not sure, actually. Or maybe I just wait a bit longer. Yeah, okay, probably need need to wait, actually. Oh, you know, do this. Oh, the, uh, the jolly's gone. Um, rip. Yeah, I think, I think this is actually what you need to do. Oh, god. Yeah, you probably don't need to wave dash at all. Um, improvised strats. Never mind, I was going to improvise a strat. But, you know, it didn't work well. So, maybe just do this one first. There we go. Nice. 
Uh, when was the berry, by the way, just so I don't lose track? Oh, it's probably in this room, actually. Oh yeah, it's literally this passageway to the left. Okay. So I can definitely get that. Do you even have to actually do the room? I think you can just do this. But yeah, you can totally just do that. Easy. And I assume this was the berry room? Yeah, okay. Let's see. Okay, so I need to... I need to activate that button. Oh, there's springs, so I can just drop it. Okay, so probably just this actually. Oh yeah, 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 okay. So... No. The, the first one was better. I don't know. Yeah, this. And then I just... Uh, do something. Yeah, I need to let go of this at a very specific time so I land on top of the jelly. I think I need to let go of it. Yeah, basically immediately. And then I need to- oh yeah, yeah, I need to do a super dash off that. Uh, so I'm safe, and then the jolly will just do the rest for me. Uh, okay, I do need to extend that. Hi, uh, three blings. How are you doing? It's probably just bling. Actually, I- Yeah, it's probably just bling. There we go. Uh, yep, yeah, that works. Uh, is the game expecting us to go back or- oh wait, no. Oh, the- what? Oh. What, why did you feel your three of blings? Yes. Oh, three teleport. So this teleports you back to this room. Why is this room even here? You can just teleport, like, Madeline back, like, in a bubble, and then just- I don't know. You're doing okay? Uh, that's good to hear. Uh, I'm also doing fine, actually. Uh, today I uh, drove again. I don't know if you, you know, heard my drive driving saga before, but it's, you know, there's been some ups and downs, but I'm making steady, steady progress. Uh, last time I was mostly just struggling with getting into. Or not getting into a park space, I'm actually fine at doing that, but then getting back out. You know, when you're uh, parked uh, perpendicularly to the road, then you have to get out uh, by driving backwards. And that was a bit hard because you have to not only drive backwards at a very slow speed, which is difficult, you know, driving fast is easier. Uh, but you also have to turn while doing that, so there's a lot of things you need to keep track of. I, all of them need to be balanced. So, uh, my problem is my speed and focusing on my surroundings. Yeah, that's that's fair. That's fair. Um, you know, I'm mostly just, um, you know, my mom is just teaching me because she's a good driver. Uh, the only problem is she's become so accustomed to it that she doesn't really sometimes know what exactly she's doing. Like last she week she was telling me, oh, you need to hit reverse and then just steer. But I was hitting reverse and steering and I was doing everything correctly. But the problem was that I was hitting it too hard. But she didn't realize, she, she actually, she said, you know what, I'll get in the car and I'll, I'll show you how to do it. And then she realized, oh, I do this thing where I um, gently, like, hit hit the reverse, then uh, not let go a bit, then hit the reverse, just gently, like in little increments, uh, instead of just hitting it uh, once really hard, which was what I was doing, which she told me to do. Um, so yeah, you have a gaming steering wheel, so I learned on that, and now I'm practicing with an actual car. Cool, sounds cool. I mean, yeah, the 
for me, you know, the, the hardest part is not actually the steering. It's just... Yeah, just mostly just... Uh... The... All of the things you need to do at once sometimes, you know, for the, the last thing I had to do. Uh... But yeah, besides that, it's been going well, and I actually managed to, the, the last time I did it, I managed to do it perfectly. You know, drive, steer, uh, all of that. Uh, and I actually drove out of the parking spot perfectly. And that felt satisfying. But yeah. Uh, I only practice in a parking lot or my neighborhood. Yeah, there's like... A road to the side of a bigger road that we use and it's really easily accessible and if you know I if my mom ever says you know I, I think you can um, drive on in actual traffic now uh, because she's trying to you know first do it on private roads and stuff or not private roads just roads where there's not a lot of traffic so I can focus on my car but then you know once I actually can drive, or once she thinks I'm ready to drive in traffic, then I can just uh, immediately do that because, you know, there's a big road right next to it, which is handy. I haven't drove in traffic yet and I don't think I'm ready either. Yeah, I don't know. We'll just have to gauge it step by step. Like, right now, it's not really... I can't really know how close I am to being able to do that. I'm just getting comf more comfortable with, you know, the car. Uh, a smaller car. Uh, it's like, I think, yeah, there's one passenger seat in the front and two in the back. So, uh, like a really small, uh, I don't know. Peugeot uh, 108 or something, or 208, like the smallest model they have, basically. Okay, that's how you're supposed to do that room. I was... Okay. Oh, they want us to do this. Okay. Uh, I'm actually thinking, wait. Do they want to do a super? Yeah, a super, okay. Just so I don't mess that up. Okay, now we have the second guy. He's gonna teach us how to do it. Wait, whoa. Whoa, that's cool. Okay, yeah, I like that. Uh, I started to drive one of my cars in a smaller car, and then I actually drove it in my neighborhood in a truck. Wait, I started to drive one of my cars in a smaller car. Oh, wow. Yeah. Like, yeah, a truck, I don't know how it is where you live, but, like, for us, like, where, where I live, like, driving a truck is a completely different driving license uh, than, you know, driving a personal car. Uh, probably if you can drive a truck, you can also drive just a normal car, but not the other way around, of course. Um... Yeah, driving license is all you need to basically drive anything. Ah, okay. Yeah. I know in the past you could just... Uh, which is... Like, this is still hilarious to me. The, the fact that in the past you could just ask for one at the town center, or the... Whatever it's called in English. And they would just give it to you. Um, like, you didn't even have to pass any exa exams or even eye tests. Uh, which I had to do after my theoretical exam, you know, just to confirm that I'm not totally blind. Um, but, yeah. Um, it's kind of funny to me, and I think you could also get one for a truck, uh, at that point. Like, even for a bus, you could just ask, like, if you had one for a car, you could just ask for one for a bus and they would just give it to you. And now you have to do that separately as well, because 
that's how that works here in, I think, just Europe. I think, yeah. That's a Europe thing. I think it is. I'm not sure, actually. Okay, well, this is a lot of uh, tech at once, but you know, it's really satisfying to do. And I also like that you don't actually have to do the wall bounce here, you can just do that, uh, which I like, because I hate doing wall bounces with a lot of momentum, because like half of the time you just mess them up. And I think a wave dash would work best there. Okay, yeah. Or maybe just a bunny hop off that, actually. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's how that works. Okay, uh, somehow I managed to grab that. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna worry about that. Well, that's nice. This, uh, the steps you're trying to do aren't too hard. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Um... focusing now. Oh god, what do I do there? Okay, um, I managed to get most of this. How long is this room? Jesus, okay, thought it was almost done. Okay, so, yeah, you get the thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, and now you just dash through with the jolly or something, I don't know, then get that button, and then you just get rid of the jolly because you can uh, wave dash. Uh, yeah, you do another dash, you get that spring, you go up, up some more, and then you get to the end. Okay. Okay, so I don't actually need to worry about that jolly anymore after I do that. I love how I can just fly through that. <laughs> like, it seems like you would need to dash through that. But you don't. You can just... Yeah. Like, basically, these blocks are just a dash crystal, but larger, so you don't miss it. Nice feature. But yeah, anyway, like, about the whole driving in traffic thing. Um, like, I know people, like, there's one person who got their theoretical uh, license, or their provisional license, after doing their theory test, like, uh, a couple days before me, and they got the license, like, a day after me. Um, so, they're, like, on the same trajectory as I am, but they're, like, you know, their parents are doing it in a very different way. Uh, they're also doing it a lot more frequently, which I probably should be doing, but I just don't have time. Um, and also, he's actually driving in traffic a lot. Which, I don't know if that's the most responsible decision by the parents, because, you know, someone who has only driven a car for about a month should probably not be on the road immediately. But, you know, it's working out for them, so who am I to judge? I just don't think it's... I just don't think it's that good of an idea. It wouldn't work for me. I, I, it'd be too, uh chaotic. Oh. Oh, yeah, okay, just... 
assume I got that. Oh, it's close. I've only drove like eight times before I definitely need to drive more and I... Ah oh, yeah, you definitely need to drive more and get a proper license. Wait, you don't have... Oh. Um... Or you, you mean like the final license, like when you do your driving exam, or like you don't have like the papers to even drive, or like, I don't know, like, I don't know what you mean by proper license. But uh, I've only driven like, the, the, today was like the fifth time. I skipped a couple of weeks because I was ill, and also because I didn't have time again, so, yeah. But besides that, I've do done it every week. I only skipped uh, two weeks, I think. Actually, one of them I didn't skip, I just did it on a different day. I think. I don't remember. Uh, anyway, hi, uh, Rudolph. How are you doing? I don't have a permit, so legally I'm not allowed. Wait, wait, allowed to. Reason I also have eight times I've never drove alone. Yeah. Yes. Um. I'll try to actually wait. Okay. So legally I'm not allowed to. Ah oh, yeah yeah okay. Yeah, the, the law here in Belgium also states that you have to, when you're learning to drive, you always have to drive with someone. Um, you can't do it without a supervisor. Uh, and that's either someone from, you know, a school uh, that you pay for, or it's, you know, your parent, your family, just anyone you choose, but it has to be on your driver's license, so you can't change it easily. Like, I can't just suddenly say, you know what, I, I don't feel like it. Um, you know, instead of my mom teaching me how to drive, it's gonna be my dad. Uh, which would be a terrible idea, by the way, because he can't drive at all. But, you know, I couldn't do that, even if I wanted to. Uh, you're doing acceptable. That's... I mean, yeah, that's acceptable. Understandable. Have a nice day. Do you know about permits? Um, I mean, I know what a permit is. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't really know what the question is here. Like, or was it not meant for me? I don't know. I I'm just kind of confused. I'm, I'm. The the game is. You know, I'm, I'm fo trying to focus on the game and also on making proper sentences and actually reading chat. And, you know, sometimes my brain just kind of malfunctions. Yeah, as I was saying, multitasking is hard. You know, with the whole driving backwards thing. And stream is basically like driving, in the sense that if you're drunk, it gets harder. I'm not drunk, by the way. Don't drive drunk. DDD. I was just wondering because I don't know if there's permits where you are. Oh, um... Yeah, it's basically just you have a provisional license to drive, which is when you get your... you pass your theory exam. And then you also have... Damn it, that was close. Uh, you also have your practical exam, 
where you actually have to drive. The, you know, the theoretical exam is just a bunch of questions uh, that you answer on a computer. Um, and then, yeah, the practical exam is actually doing it, and after that you get your final license, which means you can do whatever you want uh, with it, you know, you can drive with as many or as few people as you want, you can drive alone, you can drive at night, which I'm not allowed to do uh, on Fridays, Saturdays and Sundays, because they probably fear that people will be too drunk at that point of the day, uh, so they just don't allow it. But yeah, that's how the system works here. I don't know how it works where uh, you live. Oh god! Okay. Somehow I managed to almost save that. Okay, please don't mess up. I messed up. Okay, same thing again. Please don't mess up. I just beat the room. Let's go. Okay. Second time's the charm. Right? You probably- you probably just have to do this, actually. I'll read that in a sec. Uh, so permit here you can get at the age of 15 to 18 and it's basically a thing where you're able to learn to drive and not get trouble but you have to someone have a car with you with a bicycle. Yeah, exactly. Uh, for us it's... I didn't, I didn't realize that that's what you meant by a permit but that's basically the same thing as a provisional license uh, here. Uh, except it's uh, 17. And it's, you know, you do have to pass your theory uh, exam. Um, so, you know, might not beat 17. Uh, that was... Yeah? Wait, I'll, I'll save the... No. The, the moment I say I'll save this, I don't. Let's just not mention saving this time. Wait, <laughs> I want to buff the jelly. Let's go. Okay, yeah, save vault, save vault. I've been trying, trying to get the driver's permit, but your mom won't let you. Oh. Um, well, tell her that if she doesn't, um, you're engaging in illegal activity and it's because of her. So, you know, she's liable. I mean, it's not even like I'm making this up, it's just, it's true from what I can gather. Okay. Okay, I need to drop that and then do something with it. But yeah, the law is like very strict here about, you know, if you drive without a permit or a license, then you get fined a lot. Even if, even if you haven't, like, even if you're the owner of a car, you let someone else drive with your car and they don't have a permit, then you can get sued for that, or you can get fined for that. That's the state of Belgium. 
I think when I turn 18 I can get a driver's permit without having to take quiz about driving. You know, that might be the case, I don't know. Um, we always have to do that, you know, regardless of age. But it's mostly just people who are, like, 17 who do that. Um, I, I keep forgetting I need to drop the jelly. Drop that jelly on the floor. Jelly type beat. You know. Saveable, 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 totally saveable, totally. Um, I'm probably not even going up. I can barely tell that I'm going up. I'm s going ever so slightly upward. This is not saveable, okay. I was going to say I don't have a derpy mode, but I think Riley specifically said uh, that they're not okay with that, so, which I didn't respect. I was just thinking about it. Like, I have them in my Discord server. Derps. But, um... You know, Twitch is... Just feels different, you know? And also, like... Yeah. Like... It's not like I could even get... Like, added. Because I don't have affiliate. I think you can only get emote slots if you're affiliate. Hey, I actually managed to save it. Never mind. Um, is this close enough to, to derp? Or this is close enough to derp? What even is that? PR chase. Sure. It, it passes for me. I would give this guy a permit. <laughs> it's a funny emoji, it sure is. You can probably use it in some contexts. Like a lot of emojis, but... Um, You know, it probably doesn't work as well in other context. Again, like most emoji. I don't know where I was trying to go with that. Okay, saveable? No. No. <laughs> I'm not even going to mention it now. I don't think that is ever saveable. He looks like he'd watch you eat cereal. <laughs> That's a very specific thing to say, but. You know, let me look at it again after this attempt. Maybe it maybe it is. Oh! Wait a sec. I can probably just drop that and have that work. Why do I keep not dropping it? You know what, I'm, I'm going to resort to using the D-pad again, because I think it's, you know, the fact that I'm playing this with a joystick that's making this hard. There we go. We died immediately after, but I got the drop. The drop. Yeah, okay, and then you just probably just do a wave dash. Oh, 
Oh, almost. How long is this room, by the way? This is probably like the tip of the iceberg. Oh yeah, I, I, I think you can dash up and then immediately do a wave dash. Because you're technically sort of in the air. Yeah, nice. Okay. I like this game. That was not it. Okay. How long is this room, by the way? I wanted to check. Oh yeah, I was also going to check. Um, yeah, that does look like the type of guy who would watch you eat cereal. <laughs> the fact that I'm saying that, just... What does this dream become? You know, I like the streams where I'm... Oh! Thanks for the follow. I think the alert did the alert actually worked for once. Did, did something show up? Did, did you hear a sound effect? I don't know. I think I think that worked. Oh, uh, hi, um, Lara Vakyok. I think the follow was from you. I assume it is. Yeah, yes, it did. Okay, good. Um, because I I had a problem with my stream alerts, and I wanted to see if I was actually fixed or not. But yeah, um, I'm doing good. Um, how about you? I'm just basically... Uh, I'm, I'm vibing. I don't know what else to say. Like, yeah, it's, uh, we've had a re week off school this week, and I've had a lot of time to work on stuff. You know, school assignments. Um, but also considering it's the last year of secondary school, I'm also looking uh, for stuff about uni next, next year. Um, you're doing good? Okay. That's good to hear. Uh, but yeah, I'm looking for stuff like info about uni uh, next year and I've actually I think I've made a decision on what I'm going to study next year and I, I don't know if I've said it on stream already actually there's no way I could have said it on stream already because I I only found out last Wednesday uh, but I'm gonna be studying physics next year that's like a 99% chance like I'm still going to go to like info moments, events and stuff, but um, that's mostly just to confirm that I really want to do that. But like, I want to an open lesson, which is basically just, yeah, a lesson that anyone can attend, uh, that they handpick. Um, and you know, it was a physics lesson and I just really enjoyed it. And there were a lot of other subjects or other things that I also did open lessons for, and they were also interesting, but physics just had that extra oomph to it. So I think I'm going to go for physics. Uh, someone pinged me on Discord. Uh, oh, it's just someone's gone live. Never mind, they're not live, but they, they pinged to announce something. Oh god, okay. You're a big fan of this game? I mean, it's a good game. So yeah. Good taste. Good taste. Also, I did this... <laughs> I've done that twice now. Um, just go above the jolly. Going above the jolly. Yeah. But yeah, I'm really struggling with neutral dropping, because um, I'm playing this with a joystick mostly, as you can see. 
um, and you know that uh, it's really hard to just hold down immediately. So I'm trying to use the D-pad instead with varying levels of success. By the way, uh, Laura, um, like, what lobby uh, have you, like, are you in in this mod, or is do you just like Celeste Vanilla, like? Because not right now I'm playing a mod, uh, as you might have noticed. Uh, what do you like about this game? I just like, you know, it's. You know, about the vanilla game, I really like the story, just in general. Um, you know, the story, of course, becomes a little less relevant after your first playthrough, but then it's incredibly replayable because of, you know, all the speedrun mechanics that you have. And then, just, yeah, there's an incredibly high skill ceiling. Uh, like, the vanilla game doesn't get to anywhere near this level of difficulty. Um, and it's just fun to see, like, how mods can go so much further also. Um, and even in the main game, you can do some insane strategies and, and challenges. Like Grabless, which I, um, I recommend anyone do, but also I dissuade anyone from doing it. Um, it's a bit weird. It's like a really fun challenge, but it's also, you have to be slightly insane. Okay, that was almost it. And also, um, one thing I like about this mod in particular is I have lots of small maps. So like, once you get bored of one, you can just do another one. Now, I have done every map up until this point um, in this mod, but I can always skip one if I don't feel like doing it. And I can just uh, take a break from it also. And there's just there's just a lot of a lot of creativity on display. Each map is unique. Um I'm trying to think of two that are the same or like similar, but I can't think of any. Except the puzzle maps. Those all suck, but you know, they're still different. Technically. way too fast. Ooh, doo -doo -doo. Do you stream daily? Um, I stream every week. Uh, I don't have time to stream daily. I wish I could, but I just... It's cool. Yeah.
Alright, but it's usually every Sunday at the same time, so like usually at this time. I tend to stream more during the holidays, or for longer periods, because I just have a bit more time. Like, for school, I, you know, I have to get up, I have to, you know, go to bed at a certain time, so I need to stop a bit sooner. Oh, that sounds awesome. Keep it up. But do you have any plans to stream daily? I don't know. It's like... I like streaming, but it's like... It's also a bit exhausting for me, so... Like, I'm thoroughly enjoying this. Like, that's not the problem. But, uh, to do it, like, every day, that's like, not... I don't think that's my cup of tea. I also just like to do a lot of different things. Like, I also make videos, so, you know, most of my free time is either spent streaming or making videos. Or playing music, or other things. I do a lot of things, actually. Saveable, saveable, saveable. But uh, anyway, I was thinking, if you uh, like Celeste, I don't know if you've heard of the recent Celeste 64 game. Uh, you know, the one, the, the 3D Celeste game that was made for the 6th anniversary. Um, well, I'm also fixing to start up my channel in the art category soon where I'll be live with all my artistic creations. Oh, that, that sounds uh, interesting. Yeah, um, I'm not artistic and in the slightest. So... You know. Like I'm... Trying to think of a good thing I made in art once and like an art class, and there's basically only one thing. It's like we had to draw a bear at some point. Don't ask why. Uh, and that was pretty good. I, I still have that hanging up somewhere at my dad's place. Um. But um. Yeah, besides that, uh, my artistic abilities are that of a shrimp. Actually, probably a shrimp has more artistic ability than me. Would you like to connect on Discord? Um, oh, sure. Um, I actually have a Discord server, so... There you go. Um... But maybe, yeah, you can also DM me uh, the artwork. Uh, I don't really mind. You know, as long as it's safe for work. <laughs> um, in that case, it's all fine. I'm good. Actually, I'm noticing lots of emotes. Yeah, I'll have a look at that in a, a sec. You know, after the stream, I am just gonna keep streaming for like I don't know a half an hour. Um,
Yeah, it would be good if I actually beat this room. <laughs> Let me just check. Uh, man. Okay, how many rooms are there after this? Oh, is this the last one? I think it's... Oh, uh, it's, it's straight up just the last room. Okay. Um, I'll read that in a second. Well, the thing is I specialize in providing creative surfaces for content creators, including logos, VTuber, overlay, emotes, animation, and more, so it would be interesting. Uh, duh. I'd have to think about that, but for right now I think it's a no. But, uh... Yeah. It's a bit of a, you know, it's one of those questions you have to think about, so I'm just gonna not impulsively say anything. You can see my work and let me know. Okay, that's fine. The thing is, I also, just financially speaking, I don't know if I'm actually gonna be able to do that. Um, but, you know, I'll see. not extending my dash there. on how long it takes to beat this room but I'll probably have time to like start with the next map but then I'll probably have to quit halfway through uh, because uh, I need to go and like actually no wait I have still have a bit of time but still I'm not going to be able to finish the next map fully supposed to do that part differently but I uh, am just not I'm just not good at doing that the entire way you know by all accounts this is actually a very short map this is the last room it's just the rooms are hard, so it'll end up taking as long as any other map.
Ooh, okay. Almost saved that. No! Ugh. I knew what I had to do and I just didn't. Okay. I'm just not going to say a lot, I'm just in focus mode right now. Because I, I know I can beat the room, I just did basically everything that's hard about the room and I know how to do the last part, I just need to do it now. trying to think of something else to say to fill up the silence. Um... Yeah, I've said most of the things that I did this week, so... What else is there? Oh yeah, the... the best coincidence ever. Uh, so... I was doing open lessons this week for a uh, uni, and one of them, or one day I had like three open lessons, and just very um, coincidentally, there was someone from my class in one of the open lessons. It was discrete maths, it wasn't that interesting. Uh, we both agreed on that. Then I go to the next open lesson, uh, she also still had one, had one to do, and uh, it was a different one. But then, uh, in the next lesson, I come across a different person, also from my class. <laughs> it was just, like, not even, like, from the same school. Like, literally the same class. Like, how? That is, like, the coincidence of all time. Like, to be fair, like, it was something related to sciences, and we are in a science and math class. But... Still, like, that is... Like, there's still a lot of people who are in a science and math class that is different than the one we are in. So... Even then, the probability is not that high. And just the probability of seeing someone from your own school in these open lessons is not incredibly high.
I would actually like to get this within the next few minutes. Because this, like, I know how to do this. Please, just give it. Just give me the W. Thank you. Ah, that was close. Okay. I, I thought... I, I had, like, the feeling that one was going to be it. But it wasn't. <sighs> no, doing that one legit, or like, with the intended strategy is actually way harder than just the strategy that I have. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. That platform goes away. Okay, so I need to do two wave dashes there. this today. Ah, oh, okay. Still have a lot of time. I'm just getting fed up over this. There we go. It's not that hard. Just need to fo oh. Just need to focus. to make that one. Run, run, run. No, <laughs> that was it. If you're wondering why I said run, I mean, like, this is the run. I'm just, yeah. You know what I mean. Ah, oh, damn. Please just do it. Yet. Let's go! Ah, that, was, that felt satisfying. Okay. We have jellyfished the sanctum. I want to get the hard ultra. Or not. <laughs> one, one hour and four minutes. Let's go. Exactly. Well, anyway. I got all of the barriers, right? Yeah, there was only one. Okay, time to start with one more stage, and then I'll probably end it there. Ooh, this looks cool. Slime Time by Oppen. I think I've made this joke before, but 
Oppenheimer. Okay, sorry. Um, uh, yeah. That, that was a terrible joke. I shouldn't have made it twice. Even if I haven't made it twice, I, I shouldn't have. Yeah, this looks... Um, you know, very colorful. I'm digging the vibe. Uh, let me just check. There's one berry here, one berry in a separate room. Uh, one berry in this humongous room. And that's it. This is, um... You know, this this OST is giving me some weird vibes. Whoa, those are uh, interesting bubbles. Yeah. Wow, okay, so these basically go instantly. Okay, but the, these rooms, uh, the, the first room went pretty, pretty quickly. I can't remember what the... Um, I forgot to check what difficulty this map was. You know, maybe it's green and just the entire map is not that hard. Or maybe it's not. Uh, what do I do there? So I go, I do a wall bounce, I grab onto this and then... Oh yeah, 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 you can weigh that block down with your body weight. You know... Oh no, 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 wait, it's just a crumbling block. Okay. That also works. Uh, now what? Um... Yeah, the spring is kind of making it hard to do anything here. But I somehow managed to do that. Okay. This is... you know... I, I'm not seeing where the slime part of this is quite yet. Maybe th there's a bit of slime on these spikes. But besides that... I don't know. Just like... Just looks like so, some, you know, colorful map. Something you'd see in like a children's book or something, I don't know. Do you, do you think I know what a children's... Like, what like that kind of book looks like? It's been ages since I've been a child. Actually, I'm still technically a child. In two months, I turn 18. So... Okay, I need to get that somehow. Oh, you just do this. That's way simple. Yeah, you just do. Okay. Yeah, that th this makes a lot more sense now. I was really confused with the blocks, but uh, yeah, it all makes sense now. Okay, and now you probably just have to dash back the same way you came.
Okay. <laughs> Somehow managed to save that. But yeah, these rooms are definitely not as difficult as Jollyfish Sanctum. But there's just more of them from what I can tell from the debug map. You know, maybe maybe it'll get hard. But most maps actually do get hard at some point. Uh, so far I haven't missed anything, I think. Just want to check. Yeah, uh, we're in this room. Wait, Opp- <laughs> It actually does say Oppenheimer. <laughs> the game- the game made the joke for me. <laughs> Gala, Oppenheimer. Gala, Oppen, Tilt the Stars. Tilt the stars, tilt the stars. Okay, yeah, so th they only did that for that one specific room because Oppenheimer made this room. Must be explosive. Um, let me actually have a look at this. Okay. Oh, the barrier is right there. Uh, how are you going to get that? Maybe there's a hidden platform somewhere? Or like, uh, one of these walls is not actually real. I'm guessing the green one isn't real. The, this long green one. Uh, and then, yeah. Okay, let's just see what happens, I guess. Wow, well, that... I f already find wall bounce is difficult, and now you have this, which just instantly... Makes you oh god. Like I already find it hard to time a wall bounce. Why do you have to do this to me again? But no, in, in all seriousness, it's a cool mechanic. There we go. Just need to get the hang of that. I I like also that they're using the bubbles, uh, the fast bubbles sparingly. You know. They could have just made every green bubble a fast bubble. Uh, which, you know, would have made the map more difficult, but uh, it would have been a bit frustrating. I don't know, the fact that there's a bit of variety in one of these um, bubbles go also means that it's a bit more interesting. You know, I like myself some diversity. Okay, let's quickly talk about something else before the stream gets political again. You know, just bringing, bringing up the word diversity probably upset some people. Probably didn't actually, I'm just probably- I'm, I'm definitely just imagining that. That part is just lightning fast. Bam, bam. Okay. <sighs> oh, almost got that, okay. It's basically just anticipating the bubbles. Um, there is an insane amount of words related to politics. True. I, I remember my um, history teacher um, once said, you know, everything is politics. Like. The, the simplest things that you can think of, like going to the store, are politics, because taxes, and who pays those taxes, and how should the taxes be distributed, and how much should um, a retail worker make. That's all, that's all politics, man. 
It's futile to pr try to omit them all. True. I was also just joking when I said that, by the way. Although, I don't want the stream to get political. That's like, that's not a joke. Like, I had it happen once, and it was fun for a moment, but I wouldn't want to do that again. Or it would have to be with, like, friends, if we're, like, joking around. green block wasn't real. And uh, now I actually have to get out of here, which is going to be a bit more difficult, actually. Um, almost managed to save that. I, I thought the game would just teleport me, but no. I do actually have to beat the room. Um, so yeah, we know that that's there now. So I assume you just don't dash, you get that. And then you dash to the next one, and then you're basically there. Okay, so I was... I could have almost gotten that, actually. But I didn't. So let's just do it now. have to get that without dashing. That's quite difficult, actually. What if I don't grab onto that? I don't know, maybe, maybe that helps. Um, let me try that. Oh, you can just stand. <laughs> that was so stupid, okay. I was not expecting that, okay. Wow. I I'm glad the game didn't even acknowledge that, like, there was not even a secret sound effect, like... The game just kind of expected you to know that there was no- no platform there. Uh, uh, you- yeah. <laughs> okay. So now I know how to do that part, you just have to do the room twice. Wait, but... Huh? Oh, wait, I think the platform is supposed to go in there. That's it. Oh, okay. So somehow I need to... Uh, yeah, okay. Probably didn't need to dash there. Yeah, I definitely need, didn't need to dash there. If I hadn't dashed there, then I would have probably beaten the room. Oh, by the way, I like the random telephone sound effects in the OST. I assume those are telephone sound effects.
There we go. Yeah. Perfectly saveable. I just didn't have enough stamina there. Okay. <laughs> We're getting this uh, on one of the next attempts. Would, have been, would be weird if I got it on a past attempt. Because then I wouldn't be here. Would also be weird if I didn't get this. But that's technically possible. It would just be a massive skill issue. Okay, sorry. Uh, my uh, mom came in. I'll probably beat this room and then I'll stop because I need to... She brought me dinner, so I need to... You know, how did I not activate the platform? <laughs> okay, I know you can do that, I know you can grab on a platform and not activate it, but still. Like, that's precise. The fact that I managed to do that. You know, is impressive, but also not ideal. So close. Oh my god, no. Nice, I think that's it. Yeah, let's go. Alright, um, I'm calling it there. Because, um, yeah. The food is here, and I kind of want to eat it, otherwise it's going to get cold. Uh, so, we did three rooms. I thought I did more, but hey. How many rooms are there in total? Uh, eight. So, you know, almost halfway. Right? Oh wait, this berry room also exists. Okay, never mind, we're not close at all. Um, but yeah, that's the stream. Uh, I'll stream next week. You know, I'm also... I, I have to do Celeste uh, 64 Grabless at some point. I have to finish that. And also Windswap Jumpless. But I'll do Windswap Jumpless off stream for a bit. And then I'll come back, uh, you know, for the post game. Because right now I still need to get collectibles. And I'm just going to do that off stream. And for Select 64, I'm not sure. I might... I don't know, I might do that next week. I'm not sure. I'll keep you updated. Uh, you can always check the Discord server if you want to know about that. Um, yeah, that's it basically. Uh, let's check who's live. Uh, let's raid Ghost. Or wait... Oh no 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 wait, I'll, I'll raid Foul. Because they're doing Grabless, and Grabless is objectively perfect. Raid Foul. I, I raided them last time, but I didn't have much time to actually watch their Grabless runs. Um, but now I'll have time while I'm eating. So, yeah, cool. So, yeah, 
Um, I'll post the schedule in the Discord. It'll just be a Sunday stream, but I don't know what yet. And besides that, yeah. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the stream. Uh, I'll check Laura's art. I also need to do that. I forgot. Uh, and then, yeah. Uh, have a nice day and keep being mad lads.